Okay, here I'm going to use my multimeter. Going to use the ohm setting on the multimeter. Move my selector switch to ohm. I know I'm in ohms. I got the O dot L up, up top. So I'm all set to read ohms. I got my red lead in the ohms jack. And I have the black lead in the common jack. So I'm all set here. Meter set up. I'm going to be checking this cable right here. Give it a glance over. Look for any visible damage. And I don't know if I can zoom in where you can read this, but this is an RG59 cable I'm testing. Okay, I'm in the ohms position. I'm going to get my meter leads. And as you know, the first thing you want to do is check, make sure your meter works. Make sure your leads are good. And see what kind of ohm value it comes up by itself. And it was 0.2. Now I'm going to take one of my meter leads and press it against the side at a coax nut because we know that's connected to the outer shield the braided shield and it reads open I have my other meter lead on the center stinger and it reads open so I know my cable isn't shorted internally okay now I'm going to take my uh, set of jumper cables and whenever you use test use equipment for testing you want to test your equipment to make sure it's working so I'll take one side of the alligator clips, hook it to a meter lead and hook the other side up. And as you can see, I'm reading 0 0.5, 0 0.6. So I know my jumper leads are good. Okay, so now I'm going to take my jumper leads, get the one end of my coax cable, and I'll connect one alligator clip to the nut on the, on the connector. And I'll take the other jumper lead and connect it to the center stinger. So what this does is it's shorting my stinger to the outer shield of the coax. Okay, once I have them together, then I'll get to the other side of the coax cable. And like before, Connect one meter lead to the outside of the shield and the other meter lead I'll put on the stinger. See, you can see I got good continuity. I'm reading two point something, the three ohms throughout that connector cable. So we know this piece of coax is a good piece of coax. I got good continuity. I got good ohms. Yeah, I hope this video was helpful and thanks for watching.